I feel like room transformations are not the same without the before and after. So here's the before. Welcome to the transformation. I don't know how I'm going to do this. Joe left for a bachelor's trip, so I'm by myself. And whenever he leaves, I have to find a project to entertain myself. So this is my next project, fixing Athena's room. This is going to be the baby's room. She's going to sleep with me for the first year anyway. So I think this is more for myself so I can see a beautiful room for my baby. <laughs> this is a king bed. I don't know if I'm going to be able to move it. I don't know if I can move it, you know. I shouldn't but i'll figure it out so welcome i can't believe my eyes when i get close to you close to you close to you you said i'm gonna try to move <clears throat> the mattress but if it's too heavy i'm just gonna leave it and wait for my sister and my mom to come and then they will have helped me but if i can manage i could i'll just move it myself not bad at all my camera is gonna die so i'm just gonna take the mattress out and then i'll see you in a bit i found a photo of joe when he was younger i'm gonna frame this <laughs> Guys, I did it. Mm -hmm. What? I took everything out. Well, there's still the chairs in here, but I think I'm gonna need them for painting. But look at this room. Oh my God, it's so clean. I vacuum, so I'm gonna mop it. Or should I just do everything else and then finish it off? Yeah, I vacuum, so I'm fine. I'm just gonna mop at the end. Now. The project is to paint the walls white and I am gonna paint a mural in here that I designed based on some characters I saw on a bedding sheet, a baby bedding sheet. So I just rearranged the characters, duplicate some stuff. I just made like a whole mural out of those little drawings. So they're actually not mine. I didn't make them up, but I it took them from somewhere. I will show you if you're interested in their bedding. I will put a link, but I I think I'm gonna get the bedding. But besides the bedding, I'm gonna do the design on this wall as an accent wall. So the idea is that <clears throat> it looks like a storybook, like a coloring book. That was Joe's idea, and then I just came up with the design and everything. I think that's what's gonna take me the longest because it's very detailed. Um, I will put a picture in here yeah this is what it looks like so I think this is gonna take me like a month so I just I think what I should do is just paint all the walls white first and then leave the designing for the end even though I want to do it right now because I'm very excited so we'll see what happens certainly I couldn't wait so I started the wall first the design and the mural and then I painted the rest away because that's me I, I just um that's the way i work so let me show you how it's going right now i just made i don't know if you can see it but i just made a sketch with chalk i had this chalk at home and i sketched everything on the wall i thought it was easier i was gonna paint the wall white first but then i thought i thought the sky is blue the wall is already blue it'll make make it easier so if i want to paint something else down here to make it like mountains and stuff i can add that but i think i can use the blue so that's what i'm going to do um i am going to start painting now i have this bunch of little paint that joe's mom gave me so i remember oh my god i have this paint i can actually start because i was gonna um order paint 
but I don't have to because I have a lot of this. So when I run out of all of this, then maybe I will buy more. It's going to look very rough at the beginning, but I think it's going to take shape later on. Let me put my camera on a time, la time lapse and I will see you in a little bit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In your body, she know even trying, she got it. Yeah. I be here beside you, anything I got you. You no know play, all you do is shut down the wrong way. Looking dangerous like a gunplay. Yeah. They all wanna grab you on you like a tattoo. Hey. Guys, if you want to see more vlogs from me, don't forget to subscribe. It's totally free and you're all welcome here. tape actually works. Sometimes if you don't place it right, it just doesn't work. Nice. Hi you guys. It's been three days <coughs> since we started and I finished painting all the rest of the walls white. Let me show you a sneak peek. Ooh, and then everything else is just very white. 
and back to me. Oh, and I also got a name for Athena, like for the wall, huge name. That comes in like a week. So, see you then. Good morning. I know I've been gone for a very long time and some of you have been asking me, girl, where are you at? I'm here. I just took some time to myself and to do nothing because I don't know, I was just tired and I didn't want to do anything. But I'm back in my grind. I want to show you how the wall turned out after I painted it. The room is a mess right now because I've been separating the stuff that people have given me already and like, thank you so much. <laughs> so let me show you the wall and disregard the mess in the room, okay? This is the wall, this is how it came out. I went ahead and put the Athena name up. I painted it white, there's only one coat so I might do something to it, maybe polka dots, maybe, I don't know. But for now I like it like that since the wall is so colorful. All right, I moved the stroller. Um, this is this corner, I think this is my favorite corner with the <clears throat> octopus and the crab and the little whale. So, yeah, that's how it turned out. Let me put you here. Hopefully you don't fall from there. I'm drinking milk, by the way. I just had a PB&J. <laughs> so, what's next? I wanted to start washing the baby's clothes, but it's still too early. I'm halfway there. I'm 19 weeks today, 19 weeks and two days. I'm like a week away from being halfway there. And... I don't think it's a good idea to wash it. I mean, I could wash it now and then put it in baggies so it doesn't get dirty. And that will make it easier, you know, so I don't have to wash so many at the same time. But I don't know. I think I might leave that for later because even though if I wash it, it'll still be on the floor because I don't have any of the dressers or anything. But guess what? The crib is coming this weekend. And I cannot wait to put it together and just put it in there and then just come and stare at it and like <sighs> yes and of course i'm gonna film that for you of course i hope you like this video i know it was a little like all over i was i don't know i feel like i'm not very very good at filming because i am not very good at multitasking so while I was doing the wall, I was so focused on the wall, I forgot I was filming and sometimes I would be on the way, like I will do, I will be doing something and then you couldn't see anything because I was right in the middle, you know? And then sometimes the phone or the camera will fall down and then I will realize like half an hour later when I was half done, I don't know. But I hope you liked it. I love it. I. I love it but I also have mixed feelings I don't know I feel like at the very beginning my idea was something like this yeah very like angelic and tame and like very oh, wide in paradise and then Joel told me he wanted something like a storybook something like out of a storybook so I don't know and then I looked this up I put it all together from sheets like crib sheets and if you notice, every section of the sheets, I'm gonna show you all the three sheets that I took. It's this three. These were not my ideas, like the little drawings. I actually saw them somewhere else and then I put them in my wall. Um, that's it. So I will see you next time. Next time will probably be me cleaning a little bit the room and then putting the crib together, which I am very excited. And then the following one, might be me actually arranging the room and like putting the stuff on it but i'm not sure yet because i still don't have half of the room so i only i will only have the crib so see you later see you around 
Bye!